As I drove in and saw the patients um, standing in line, it, it got me teary-eyed. Just They're so desperately in need that they're standing outside early in the morning to get anything. I, I don't know what their expectations are, but I'm sure that they'll be satisfied or at least out of pain once they leave here. You're in pain? Okay, do you want us to be seen by an EMS? Okay. In 2010, the state eliminated the emergency dental benefit from the state budget under our access or Medicaid program. Um, we've looked at data for emergency room visits since 2009 and found that they have increased by 30 percent and increased in cost by over 30 million dollars during that time. There's been a tremendous cost to our health care system locally and the demand just keeps increasing every day because people will put off this dental care thinking that it's less important than their overall physical care and not understanding the connection between good oral health and their overall well-being. Well those are really wasted dollars that are consumed and we've got uh, you know a limited amount of healthcare dollars available and uh, it's a shame that people with oral health problems take up time, space, and money in emergency rooms. We need to understand that the people that are here are people that probably wouldn't get this work done anywhere else. It's not like uh, most people that maybe have insurance or something else. These are people that have teeth that are broken, infection, they have teeth that are gone, and they think that this is one of the few places that they can get dental treatment. And this is one of the few places they can get dental treatment right now. There are other community clinics that are helpful, but nothing on this scale. I just talked to a young lady who had four front teeth replaced this morning. Um, she's been in pain for years and had no place to go, and she is literally walking around smiling, giving her testimonial, and it's just amazing. She said, best crystals I'm ever going to have. Perhaps next year you do it again. Well, I'm pretty sure it's a lot more people need some work done on their mouth, need dental work. I might be back next year too. <laughs> and I've seen so many people today that it's just, it really tugs at your heartstring to know that there are that many people out there that need this type of care. With my job at Delta Dental of Arizona Foundation, I'm reminded every day about the need in, in our community and the lack of access to care and what low-income families and homeless individuals are going through. There's, there's really not a lot of places to go, so that's why this event is so important.